Tuesday morning, journeying together. In the unity of Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, these hearts are joined as one. You who are in our beginning and our ending and the journeying between, be with us in this time of refreshment and oasis in the day and feed us with your word. You who are at our departing and arriving and everything that is seen, be with us as, eyes open, we marvel at all that you have made, and fill our hearts with praise. A reading from Psalm 148, uh, verses 7 through 14. Praise the Lord from the heavens. Praise him in the heights above. Praise the Lord from the earth, you great sea creatures in all ocean depths lightning and hail, snow and clouds, stormy winds that do his bidding. You mountains and all hills, fruit trees and all cedars, wild animals and all cattle, small creatures and flying birds, kings of the earth and all nations, you princes and all rulers on earth, young men and women, old men and children, let them praise the name of the Lord. For his name alone is exalted, his splendor is above the earth and the heavens, and he has raised up for his people a horn, the praise of all his faithful servants of Israel, the people close to his heart. Praise the Lord from the heavens, praise him in the heights above. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, three in one. Amen. For truth that speaks to hearts, Lord, show us your mercy. For grace beyond imagining, Lord, show us your mercy. For forgiveness from our sin, Lord, show us your mercy. Lord, you call us to be different as we journey through this day, to be a guide to those who wander. Offer help and seek the lost. Forgive us when we fail to become the people we should be. Lord, you call us to be different in the ebb and flow of life, to see the good in all your children. Demonstrate your love and grace. Forgive us when we fail to become the people we should be. Lord, you call, equip and strengthen your people for the task that within our daily journeying, we might bless the lives we meet. Amen. The God of love is merciful and will forgive those who in humility confess their sins. Let us share the peace of Christ Jesus with those around us. Peace I leave you, said Jesus, my peace I give you. Again, Jesus said, peace be with you. The peace of the Lord be always with you. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His love endures forever. A reading from the book of Isaiah. <clears throat> Chapter 40, verses 28 to 31. Do you not know, have you not heard? The Lord is the everlasting God, the creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired or weary, and his understanding no one can fathom. He gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. Even youths grow tired and weary, and young men stumble and fall. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we have also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Amen. God of morning and rising sun, with breaking dawn, the beauty of your creativity is revealed for all to see. And we shall sing your praise. God of noontime and gentle rain, you bring to us refreshment on our daily journeying and the strength to preserve. And we shall sing your praise. God of evening and setting sun, you send us out in faith and bring us safely home again. Such is your love and grace. 
and we shall sing your praise. Now may the hand of God go with us on our journeying today. The love of God surround us as we venture on our way. The Spirit of God be present in everything we say, and God's blessing be the gift that we freely give away. Amen.